Shalom, the Lord bless you. I welcome you in the name of Jesus. This is prayers and counseling with Damaris. Are you seeing me if you are very first time? You're welcome. I love you so much. God bless you mightily in the name of Jesus. Amen. If you are a new subscriber, you're welcome. I love you so much. God bless you. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, please kindly take a the minute and do that for me. The Lord bless you. Let us pray. Father, I thank you for whoever is watching me right now. I pray, Lord, for increase. I pray, Lord, for a different dimension of your glory. I pray, Lord, for plenty in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for your word. We receive it with gladness. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. God says the Bible in the Bible, there is a way that seems right unto a man, but the end thereof is destruction. There is somebody, this word is coming to you. It's a timely word to you because you feel so bad about 2023 you feel um you feel dissatisfied with 2023 you've made a lot of wrong decisions you told yourself you know what i'm not going to serve god this year i'm just going to live my life whatever comes comes whatever doesn't come doesn't come god says that path you're about to take is going to lead you to destruction god says that path you're about to take is going to lead you to destruction now, if you depend on God and you love God this much and you know in whom you serve, you know in whom you have believed, you will know that he gives you everything at the appointed time. Because in your mind, you wanted to have this thing at this year, last year, and you didn't have it. It doesn't mean that God is not faithful. It doesn't mean that God does not love you. It doesn't mean that God is not all powerful. It only means that it was not the time for you to have it. And now, child of God, God is never late. He's never too early. He's always on time. It might come late, but it will make you the latest. Child of God, the path you are about to take is only going to lead you to destruction. It's only going to lead you to an endless suffering and a place of suffering and sorrow. God is sending this word to you now because he loves you. He has your good at heart. And because you are his child, and he is a merciful God. He said a lot of horrible things. You're not going to serve God. You're not going to work. You're not going to do a lot of things you used to do. But child of God, God says you've got to come back to him and stick on that path. Because that is where your blessings will lie. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Now the Lord bless you, keep you, cause his face to shine upon you, be gracious to you, give you peace. The shalom of the Lord, nothing missing, nothing broken. I love you. Amen. Hallelujah.